Here's the Joshua Hendy Ironworks from San Francisco. Looks like a little winch that was used to uh, lift ore out of a mine. Okay, Julie, let's see your horsepower. I'm only at like a one and a half. Pretty smooth. Yeah. Oh, the old drum still spins, doesn't it? Yeah. That's pretty cool. It's pretty smooth, actually. Here are three kilns they would use to melt gold and silver doré and to purify them. Good morning YouTube mine exploring enthusiasts. Good morning. Tom and Julie here. We are out in the hills of California. We're looking at a shaft here. It's got a ladder, but it's about a 10 foot drop to get down to where the ladder starts. So we're roped in. We're tied to a tree over here. And we're gonna go down and see what we find. So let's go. Let's go. Okay, Tom's gonna make the initial descent. There is a ladder down here. Looks to be an okay shape. Okay, I see Julie making her way down up there. The ladder ends here, but there's enough footholds to walk down after that, to get down into the drift I'm in. Okay, here she comes. Okay, stop. Climb down on your left. Here? Yep. There she is. <laughs> yeah. All that climbing gear for not much use, huh? No. Okay, there's a shaft over that way. Okay. And then behind me this way is a drift. You want to come this way first, the right hand wheel? Yeah. There's some kind of a blower down here, it looks like. So we've come to some natural timbering here, unmilled. At least the posts aren't. You want to take the right? Yeah. Okay. Looks like there was some electricity in here at one time. Yeah. Looks like this is the vein they're following. Oh, I see daylight. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, we're heading back to the main drift. Okay, we're back to the main drift. And we're going to take a right and see where that goes. There's a muck sheet. It is. It's 
some pl plumbing on the ground. Mm -hmm. Here's the face. Okay, we're going to backtrack a little bit and look at the rest of this mine and other parts of it. Looks like this area they were pretty... Let's take some samples from here, Dilly. Okay. Looks like they were pretty excited about this particular area. Okay. I'll take a couple samples here from the friend Matt. Pretty hard stuff, isn't it? Yeah. Enough in that area. Yeah. We'll try another spot too. Okay. Okay, we're back to the ladders. All the can here. Nothing on it. We're moving past the ladders that we came down. There is another little lower thing here. Do you see this? Huh? No. Might be interesting. Yeah, there was some rail in here. A little skinny old rail. This is where the vertical shaft comes in. Go around. This is looking up the vertical shaft. It's not terribly deep. So here's an old chute. And then this is the vertical shaft. And I don't know if it was ever deeper than this where I am right now. It's plugged right now. So I don't know. There's a big roller. Where would that have been for? Okay, let's go past the shaft. It's a very small drift. Very small. What do you see? Lots of wood. There was that lower drift, so maybe that's what we're walking over now. Doesn't look like a very big vein to me up here that they're following. There's something else that goes down. It looks like you're dead one time. What do you see? It goes down a little ways. You can see the bottom, I think. Yeah, that's probably part of that little lower drift. And this is going to be the end of it, isn't it? Oh, well, I know. I'm going to crawl up there and lock you with me, too. You can. You can video it. Not very far though, I can see the end of it right there. Yeah. But about another 20 feet. And it goes up here too. Okay, we're going back through this door. It was just beyond the shaft. It says May there. I don't think it says what year, does it? Here we are back to the shaft. Okay, we're back to this little ladder that goes down a little bit. It doesn't look like it goes terribly far down, although there are a couple flights to it. 
But I'm going down there. I'm going to have to take everything off. All right, Tom's going to go down this lower level, check it out. It's very skinny, so I have to take everything Yeah, you have to take everything off. off. A lot of rocks here, too, that want to come down. I feel something dead down here. Uh, he'll, he'll report back in a minute. Okay, Julie's down here. So this shaft continues down over this way. We had to put our mask on, it's too dusty down here. Okay, so we found another part of the shaft. Tom's gonna see if we can get down there a little bit. I don't really know what I'm standing on just yet. Reach your arm around underneath the inside. Keep your hands free, put your lights away, whatever you're doing. Reach around with your hand now underneath. Just like you were, but a little further. Yep. Is this a ledge? Yeah, that's good to stand on. dive on it like that. Well you just, just gently get on it. <laughs> the shaft continues down quite a ways. Uh not there. Yeah. Watch your head now. Yeah. Huh? Now you can. So we're in a little drift here. Some old timbering overhead. Parts of a dynamite box. Hercules. What did you say? Little Hercules. What is it? Oh yeah. Looks like that's about it, huh? Uh, I'll look over here. A little bit. So I, so I just came from down there. And it goes a little ways this way. So let's go over here. Very narrow. I 
stuck it into the chute. It's a little ladder. Here's the ladder. I can't really see, but it looks like another ladder down there. That must be the upper level that we crossed over earlier. And there's some timbering coming down to this level. The shaft goes lower by quite a bit. I don't know how easy it's going to be to get down there. There are ladders that uh, seem to be in okay shape. Okay, we're going to go a little further down the shaft. Look at this ladder is good. It's vertical. Alright, here we go. I'm kind of at another level. Okay. Here comes Julie, vertical ladder. I don't know if this tape thing behind me is a cable or what, but I wasn't using it. I want to get out of your way. This drift only goes a few feet this way. Kind of a pit here. This is part of an atlas box. Watch your step now, hang on. So here's this strong box, like a day box for dynamite. Got box has big leather or like a fire hose hinge or some sort and it's pretty heavily duty constructed nothing in it just a piece of paper yeah a piece of dynamite, dynamite paper. paper anything else underneath that don't make a lot of dust though. just don't make a lot of dust okay not much in the box some dynamite paper the shaft keeps going down quite a ways actually I think we can cross over here, or at least I can, and explore this drift. Julie crossing the plank. Watch your head. Okay, you can send him. What do we have? Can we cross that? Yeah, you can cross Okay, there's Julie. Bonking her head again. Watch out, that timber is loose there. Do that. Just stay away from it. This one comes up to that little ladder that you could see from up above. It just looks like it goes down into a pit.
you know what I mean? Oh yeah. Ouch, out of my head. This just goes down. Kind of a pit. And this keeps going forward, it gets very skinny and I can see the face of it up there. Here's the vein they're working on. Kind of a quartzy, rusty looking thing in it. Crossing over to the other ladder. Okay. It's missing the first rung, so it's kind of a long stretch. Okay. Hear me? Yes. You can do it though. Hang on to the rods. Okay. You see what I mean when you get there. Okay. There she is. Yeah, hang on to something because that's not very sturdy. So it goes this way a little ways. What do you see? It's the tobacco can. Oh, cool. Oh, blue one, huh? I don't remember seeing blue ones before. Wow. Edgeworth, extra high grade. Huh. Ready, rubbed. Smoking tobacco. There's a nice scaling bar. Yeah. Pick it up one time. Yeah. It's about a four footer. Yeah. Least. Beautiful pry bar. Good old American steel. Yeah. Nice stuff. Yeah. So I don't think it's a very long drift, but we'll see what we can find here. There's a table. Yeah, there's a table. The rock shouldn't be on it. No, but... Let's take the rock off, can we? No, And there's a chute here, too. Bag of nails. Oh, yeah. Sure enough, bag of nails. Bag of 16 penny nails. That's about it. Yep. Well, it goes up and over. It does? Yeah. So this is back to the shaft and looking past it. It looks like there's a cave there, but it, you might be able to squeeze through that corner. But also, I can't really get across there real easily. And this shaft still goes on quite a ways. There's an old chute there with a... Uh, a retractable shoot uh, mouth you pull that wire to let it up and down so you pull it up to let the the shaft bucket or whatever go past you and then you lower it to fill all right uh, there are more ladders here I don't know if they go past this one I can't see underneath me but let's take this one and see what happens okay down we go Yeah, they are, aren't they? <laughs> They're not as nice now. Okay, where are you, Julie? Okay, shine your light oh, off to the side. There you go. 
Okay, that's looking up where I came from. You can see the old platforms and the ladders coming down the vertical shaft. I might sound a little muffled. I got a mask on. It's really dusty down here. There's an old metal chicken ladder with the hooks on top, or a hook ladder, I guess it is. And that goes down here to another little ladder. This is the bottom of the shaft right here. There's an old giant wooden uh, dynamite box. Giant special gelatin. And here's the bottom of the shaft. I'll go down there in just a second. Some kind of dead animals down there. This box says Atlas on this side. Atlas on that side. And giant on that side. Interesting. Okay, that's looking back up the shaft. You can see the ladder of uh, platforms and landings that came on the way down. Here's the steel ladders at the very bottom. And that side just has a big uh, locker. Here's something hanging in this wire. I don't know what that was. Fox, maybe. Some more parts down here. The usual death at the bottom of the mine. Here's an old uh, battery. The old lantern battery. You don't see those being used very much anymore, do you? It goes this way a little bit, but not very much. And nothing really over there, so... Alright, back up we go. Julie stayed up there. I hear somebody coming. <laughs> there he is. <sighs> oh, watch the head. All right, here comes Julie up the final piece of ladder. She doesn't hook her pack. One more step and you got her cleared. There you go. Here she comes. We made it. We survived another mine explorer. Okay. okay, Julie's got her sample for Max. I got Max's sample ready to go. Thanks for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. Alright.